Hey guys, it's Renee. So today I wanted to share with you a way on how you can remove adhesive nail tabs from like one of those press on nails that the kit doesn't include a glue because you just stick them basically. And in order to do that, I thought I would just also kind of talk about this press on nail kit that I got. It's by the brand, it's either Ampress or Impress, I'm not really sure. I've never actually used this brand before and so I just wanted to give it a try. So I bought it and I realized later that it doesn't include a glue because it doesn't need one but I prefer to glue my press on nails always because they last longer so I'm gonna be doing that and so first I really like the design of this one because it comes in a like UB French tip kind of design and I wanted to give that a try so yeah you get the instructions at the back of the box if you want to do that but again I'm not gonna be doing that this nail kit includes all of those things it's like a mini file and then like the wooden um, cuticle remover and I'm gonna be using that to remove the adhesive you pretty much have to remove first like the plastic bit and this is pretty much a, a matter of like pushing the adhesive kind of like dragging your tool so you don't damage the nail a lot of people use hot water or acetone and feel free to do that but i'm just lazy to do anything other than what i'm doing right now and this works one thing that i would suggest you is to just measure what nails are you going to be using or just potentially using just so that you don't have to remove extra adhesive from nails that you're not going to be needing you know what i mean then i'm going to be using this glue by elegant touch uh, this is another brand of like press on nails that i really like and also i really like this glue it's one of the most long-lasting uh, ones that are included in like kits now that's pretty much it as for the removal part of this i'm going to be talking now about the nails like the kit itself and i do have some observations that i wanted to share first and this is like such a petty thing to to complain about the kit like the placement of the nails like the numbers of them is really odd so you got like the zero then one then like either 10 or 11 it's like the placed the big nails and then just like the smallest ones next to them it was confusing to choose like the nails that I wanted to go for, you know what I mean? Maybe they did that so that they could um, fit like three nails in like a row. I'm not really sure, but that's the first thing that I noticed. The second thing that I noticed is like the sizing is really odd. Like you have to really file and maybe that's just mine, but my pinky, I just... Um, had to just file a lot of like the smallest nail that comes in the kit you know what i mean and yeah most of them i just had to file i know this is going to be different for everybody because everybody has like different nails and different hands but that's just my experience with this one they come with like rhinestones and the nails that include the rhinestones i couldn't use them because they are too small for the like thumb and they were just too way too big for my middle finger the rhinestone is pretty secure in there it's not going anywhere and the last observation that I had and the reason that made me realize that I'm not going to be purchasing this kit again is that they are super flimsy. They bend super easily. I found that after I glue them and just start moving or just going about my like day, if I opened the oven, if I uh, cooked, open a drawer or just uh, doing the laundry, I don't know, cleaning the house, any activity that you use your hands and your nails, I had to be extra careful with my movements because the nails are like uh, longer right and because they are so flimsy and they bend super easily especially my thumb if you stumble across something with your nail it bended i was so scared that i was gonna break it especially because i had them glued on and maybe that's why they don't include a glue for this and then just come with adhesive tabs is because these are more than anything meant for a weekend or just a special occasion or just something that you don't need them to last a very long time because they are so flimsy and the last observation that i have is only going to affect if you have shorter nail beds like i do because the pinkish part is kind of sheer you can kind of see through the other side so if you have short nails or just shorter nail beds again you're going to be able to see where your finger or nail stops but again if you have longer nail beds i'm jealous of you you're pretty lucky you're not going to be having this problem because you're not going to be having that much extra space and because of that it kind of gives like a different shade of pink but again that's just me problem or problem for people that have like shorter nail beds because when we want like super long nails we'll always see that like extra space there hopefully you find this helpful and handy and if you did don't forget to get this yet thumbs up and hopefully it wasn't too negative but they didn't really work for me check out more nail care that i have on my channel and share this thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care bye